Yo, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to another review. And today we have GGMU, the best strike back in the game. It goes by the name of Juan Bisaka. Uh, this guy played very well the last year. He was, I think, I don't know if he was 79, 80 rated last year or 81, I don't know. He got a once to watch and uh, he got a team of the season. I played with him, his team of the season last year and he was the best right back in the game. He was very overpowered. And this year too, we will try if this card is overpowered. He has 86 pace, which is very good for a right back. Passing is average, shooting you don't need, uh, I mean, it's bad, the shooting. Dribbling is very good for a right back. I mean, it's average, but it's uh, pretty good. Defending is pretty high with this card. I mean, 83 interception, 90 slight, uh, slight tackling, 85 stand tackling, which is very great. And physical stats are pretty average. I mean, the 79 stamina, I don't know how it will feel uh, in game uh, because you want your right backs and your full backs to have high uh, stamina to run faster, to go forward, and to move back. So, I mean, 85, 86 will be preferable, but I mean, I'm a, I'm a kind of player that puts his right back at stay back, so I will not feel the difference. But if you're a guy that uh, you push your guy forward, if you push, your right back, your left back forward, maybe you will feel that difference in that stamina. So I will try this card as right back uh, and as a center back because I heard the rumors that he is very good as a center back too. So you can go with many camp style on him. You can go a shadow, uh, you can go engine, you can go a guardian. But for me, I think that the anchor is the best, man. You will give that uh, boost at that pace, defending and physical stats. So with that camp style, he will go to 90 sprint speed. Uh, defending will get a massive, uh, huge uh, boost. And that physical stat will go to uh, 79 strength and 82 aggression. Uh, so let's jump in. Do we, do, uh, no, he, don't have, he doesn't have any traits. Uh, he has four star skill moves too. Oh, that's that's thing that I did not notice, which is very, very good, man. He will uh, help you a lot with that skill move and medium high which is very good as a, uh, as a right back or even as a center back so let's jump into the review let's see if he is good as right back and a center back and let's jump in man okay with our first squad he has a really good squad a really op squad so let's see what you can wambisaka let's go that's a great interception Let's take the ball forward with Wamisaka. Let's see that one, two. That's a great passing. Back to Wamisaka. Let's go, let's go. He's a beast, man, he's a beast. Wamisaka on that right back position. That's a great run from Wamisaka. Bernardo. Wambisaka, that one two. Back to Wambisaka. Let's see that finesse shot with Bernardo. No, that was wide, man. I mean, that's his poor finishing, I guess. I mean, uh, Wambisaka. Wambisaka, come on, let's go. I mean, you can see Wambisaka's uh, stamina is very low because, because uh, he's not at the stay back, he's running forward. And he's really tired, man. You can feel that stamina. Uh, if you don't put a stay back on him, he will get tired by uh, by 68 minutes. I mean, you can see that Wambisaka isn't present, man. He's not here. He's not on the field. I mean, that stamina you can see. He's not back. We we considered the goal because that right back position, was, was, there is no one. So he he was really comfortable by playing the play because Wambisaka's stamina is very low. So that's a major factor, you need to consider that. Okay, with our second game of this review, let's see who is our opponent with our second review. So he has a great squad, an average squad. So let's see what he can do. Wambisaka at the right side. Let's see Wambisaka, come on. That's your chance, mate. Let's see that run. 
Oh shit. No, 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 no. That was my fault, man. What the hell was this call, man? From a corner? Who the hell? What the, what the hell is celebration, man? Look at that, man. Clo Clodster, man. It's freaking, man. Come on, Bisaka has a center back. Let's see what he can do. That was great interception by Juan Bisaka. Let's go. I'm playing him as a center back right now. Wamisaka. Come on, Wamisaka. Come on, man. Again. Heather from the corner again. Is this a joke? Let's see who's he, his squad. That's an average squad and we will probably lose against it. So let's jump in. Let's go one second. That's mine, that's mine. Let's go, let's go one second. That's a great interception as a center back. One Misaka, let's go. No, one Misaka, you need to get that. Finally from Wamisaka, we're seeing something good from Wamisaka. Let's go. Okay guys, something good with Wamisaka. One Bisaka, I don't know about him, man. I mean, his stamina was really bad. I mean, if you check that, he, he ran forward uh, and his stamina, he, he was fatigued, man. Uh, at the 60th minute, when I got, when I put him uh, normal and not stay, wet, stay back by attacking, he was really bad, man. I mean, my right side was, there was no one because Wambisaka was running forward and not getting back. So if you're gonna uh, use this card, make sure to put a stay back while attacking with him. And if you're a guy that loves to go forward with your fullbacks, this is not your guy, man. He will be uh, really uh, exposed. He will be really fatigued by the 60th minute and you will uh, lack uh, that right side, man. And as a center back, he was good. I, I'm not gonna lie. He was good because he, he is fast. He is big. He's not thin. He's not small as a uh, fullback. I mean, he's not some like, someone like Carvajal uh, who is small. Uh, so as a center back, he was really, really impressive. So maybe use him as a center back or even as a right back, but make sure to put as a stay back while attacking on him. Uh, so this was guy. This is this is why my main concern. Uh, it was his stamina. But other than that, the card was good. He was going to, uh, forward good. Uh, his passing was good. Other than that, there is not uh, much much to say. I was not really really impressed by him. I was not amazed by him. But he was good. Nothing bad to say, but nothing good to say either, man. So thank you so much to uh, for watching this review. And I will see you on another upload, man. Peace.